It's Strawberry Story Time! Hello, little berries. Welcome back to Strawberry Story Time. Today's story is called Brave the Beaver Has the Worry Warts, written by Misty Black. Do you ever feel worried and get that funny feeling inside your tummy? Well, let's see what Brave does about his worries. Come on. The beaver family recently moved into a new lodge. Brave the beaver loved living next to a larger pond. But moving meant leaving his school and friends behind. Going to a new school felt scary. Brave wasn't feeling brave at all. What if no one wants to eat lunch with me? What if I trip on my silly webbed feet? Worries filled Brave's thoughts. His heart beat faster and his stomach ached. Then the tears came and the worrywart started popping up. Pop, pop, pop. Oh no, not the worrywarts. Brave tried to get some sleep, but when the worries wouldn't leave, he chanted. Worries, worries, go away. I won't listen if you stay. Breathe in courage, breathe out fear. Worries, you're not welcome here. He took a deep breath in and out, smiled, then peacefully fell asleep. When morning came, new worries came with it. What if the teacher calls on me and I don't know the answer? What if others make fun of my flat, floppy tail? It was hard for Brave to eat breakfast with an upset stomach. Brave's heart raced and more warts popped up when he saw how many students were in his new class. To keep from crying, Brave thought to himself, Worries, worries, go away. I won't listen if you stay. Breathe in courage, breathe out fear. Worries, you're not welcome here. He took a deep breath and his heart rate slowed. He quickly took his seat between Punk the Skunk and Quilliam the porcupine. Then one of his worries came true. Brave, said his teacher, what do spiders eat? Spiders? Yuck! Brave shivered, his heart raced again and his face felt hot. His mind went blank and he couldn't respond. Everyone's going to make fun of me, Brave thought. But they didn't. The teacher simply called on someone else. Phew, that wasn't so bad, Brave thought. While eating lunch by himself, Brave looked over and saw Tim the turtle eating alone too. He must feel lonely like me. I should go eat with him. But what if he doesn't want me to? Pop! What if he makes fun of my worrywarts? To gain courage, Brave mumbled to himself. Worries, worries, go away. I won't listen if you stay. Breathe in courage, breathe out fear. Worries, you're not welcome here. Brave inhaled some courage and walked over to Tim. And guess what? Tim did not make fun of his worry warts. Instead, Tim smiled and offered Brave a seat. At recess, Brave wanted to ask to play with someone. But who? Brave didn't have long to think about it. He heard a loud yelp and a splash coming from the pond. Help! Klutz the cat cried. Brave scurried to the pond, took a deep breath of courage and dove in. Using his fast feet and trusty tail, he sped through the water as only a beaver could. He grabbed Klutz and pulled him safely to shore. Brave's new friends cheered and lifted him up, and Brave's worrywarts were gone. Every last lumpy spot. As his friends cheered, Brave thought to himself, Breathe in courage, breathe out fear. Just like my name, I'm brave, it's clear. My worrywarts are gone. Hooray! I choose bravery today. Was it the water? Or his bravery that had washed the worry warts away? It didn't matter. Brave had saved Klutz and no worry in the world could take that good feeling away.
I hope you enjoyed that story, Brave the Beaver Has the Worry Warts. He was so brave, wasn't he? And in the end, all his worries just disappeared. Thanks for listening, guys. See you next time. Bye! Don't forget to subscribe.